grizzly bears, and the Siberian tigers, are the most ferocious wild animals ever. Grizzly bears, are the top predator, in the North American wild, while the Siberian tiger, is native to the remote forests, of Siberia. Being native to, different geographic locations, it is not possible for the grizzly bear, and tiger to confront each other, in the wild. In this video, we will analyze, the strengths of each of these beasts, and compare them, in different scenarios. Through facts, conjectures and assumptions, we will try to deduce the winner, if there was a fight, between them. The front legs of a grizzly bear, are the strongest, of all land predators. They can carry up to, 1,213 pounds, which is also equal to, 0.8 times their body weight. They have 3 inches canine, and can open their mouth, up to 16 inches wide, resulting in a biting force, of 1,200 pounds per square inch. They have fast, twitching muscles, and can break the spine of a tiger, in one single paw swipe. Whenever, confronted by another animal, the grizzly bear shatters its bones, and disables them. On the other hand, tigers have the strength, to lift twice the weight, of their body. They have 3 inches canines, resulting in a bite force, of 1000 pounds per square inch. A tiger is strong enough, to attack prey that is double its body weight, yet, in a fight with a grizzly bear, it has to avoid the blow, because a grizzly is much more massive, than a tiger. The speed, of a tiger is about, 49 to 65 kilometers per hour, which can give it a huge advantage, over the grizzly bear. Its rapid speed, and agility can surprise the grizzly bear. On the other hand, the speed of the grizzly bear is about, 40 to 45 kilometers per hour, enough to tackle the agility of the tiger. So, when it comes to speed, and agility, the tiger has an advantage. The grizzlies, are far better than tigers, when it comes to stamina, as they can run for miles, after their prey, at a good speed, and without taking a break. Comparatively, tigers have low stamina, and are often observed, leaving their prey, in a long chase. Tigers are very fast, but only in short bursts. So, a prolonged fight, between a tiger and a grizzly, would not be in favor, of the tiger. It will either retreat, or lose its life in a long fight. The tigers have, razor-sharp claws of up to, 4 inches used for both, offense and defense. They can cut, and get hooked, on the bear's skin. On the other hand, the grizzly's claws, are not but sharp, and are intended for digging, instead of cutting. When compared to grizzly, the tiger's paws, are not that strong. So, the blow of the grizzly, is more fatal, than that of a tiger. Moreover, the skin of the grizzly, is thicker and hard to penetrate, due to thick layers of fat, and long fur. So, though the tiger has better claws, but the paws and skin defense of the grizzly, are stronger, and at an advantage. Tiger has evolved, with a killing instinct. As they are carnivores, they cannot survive, without meat, which makes them expert hunters. On the other hand, grizzly bears are omnivores, with a diet that constitutes, 5 to 15 percent of meat. So they hunt small prey, and seldom attack larger animals. So, when it comes to attacking temperament, the tiger wins, as they are naturally killing machines. Grizzly bears have color vision, good hearing ability, and smelling power, equal to, 51 bloodhounds. On the other hand, tigers have excellent night vision, better hearing ability, great sense of touch, and highly sensitive whiskers, spread all over the body, to outmatch a grizzly bear. 
In the wild, there is very little, to no chance of a fight, between the tiger, and a grizzly bear. If these two beasts confront each other in the wild, in order to win, the tiger would try a strong, fast ambush attack, to bite the neck, and finish the grizzly bear. Otherwise, it may risk losing its life. On the other hand, the grizzly will tend to stand, to appear larger than its enemy, and try to threaten first. In the beginning, it will defend, and then launch a defensive offense, and prolong the fight, for a chance to deliver a deadly blow. So, the one who strikes first, will win the fight. If a tiger is able, to reach the bear's neck, it would definitely win, as it is very difficult, to get out of the tiger's jaws. And if the bear, strikes the first blow on the tiger's spine, or legs, the grizzly will definitely win. If the fight is prolonged, the tiger's chances of winning, will diminish. That's all for now, if you liked this video, give us a thumbs up, and do not forget to subscribe to our channel, for more such informative videos.